Hello, welcome back. Last time I found myself at a train station of some sort, and uh, I stopped right when mechanics were changing, so I need to learn about a new thing. You seem about the same, actually. Maybe you're just a larger version of the things I've been interacting with already. I could boost over here. Oh no, the difference is you automatically go whether I'm holding on to you or not. Um, I have suspicions. It looks to me like there's a sneaky way to go here and maybe see something. Do I smell strawberries? That's... wait a second. Are there foreground things in front of that and... yeah, okay. Uh, that crystal in the foreground made it look like I could go through there, but I could not. No, it's just a tutorial room. Okay. Uh, wait a second. Okay, that's nothing. <laughs> Could've been. Alright. That one has spikes left and bottom, retractable spikes on the top, more like extendable spikes, springboards on the right. How will I be interacting with it? Probably get on, do an extended hyper as it's moving to get extra speed, grab onto that one, and then who knows how I'm going to mess with the two as the room progresses. Just dance between them somehow to get... There are two ways to go here. I'm going to guess up is the strawberry route. It usually is if there's an up and a side. Okay. So, I don't actually need that crystal for anything. Is the suggestion then maybe to wave dash with it? So that I align my timing that way? Mm, I think the suggestion is actually a hyper bunny hop, which I did not do. Is that enough space to do that? I don't think it is. Maybe I just wave dash better, like from farther to the right. Or use a dash here and... Yeah, good luck parsing that. What the heck is going on? Okay, so that's the same as... Okay. Alright, suddenly a level has devolved into just absolute chaos. Uh, I guess I want those springboards to hit me? Yeah, it's that way around. I don't hit those springboards, they hit me. Uh, what? Okay, so go do a down right there, I guess? Well, I hit them, but I also went through and hit the spikes. How do I do anything there in that area? Okay, here's one idea. Maybe I need the top of that not to be spiky, and that's why this is as it is. That's plausible. Because that's when I need to... Uh, Mmm, that angle doesn't feel very friendly for such a thing. I don't know, I don't think that's it. Okay, that time the springboards worked. <laughs> Sometimes they will. I must have just been, like, the wrong angle. Okay, so I think ultimately what I did there is roughly what I'm trying to do. Oops. Uh, oh, getting my dash directions right, Be because it's a race, like, it's it's hard to uh, be sure of what I'm doing at any time, and I keep, my, my angle keeps being wrong there somehow. I'm, like, not getting enough speed for stuff. It's because I'm trying to go too fast. How do I have enough? I guess I need to still have uh, some uh, pink hair there. How would I do that? Well, by not dashing, I guess. Okay, okay. That worked. Alright, so this is backtrackable, which is a good sign. And I hear a strawberry, which is a better sign. There we go. This is, uh, this is quite tall. Uh, hello? Well, that's definitely something. 
That is for sure some... Th oh, I don't think I can get in there, though. No, I don't think there's any trickery that would get me in there. Because if my head hits the spikes like that, I would have to be ducked. And dashing unducks me, right? I am having trouble telling, but I think that's true. Ah, uh, hang on. I can do a weird little something. There's an input I can make that does dash me while ducked, it seems. However, I don't think that takes me high enough to get in there. That is ridiculously suspicious. Like, there's pretty much no way there isn't something there. I just don't think I know how to get there. There's definitely something there, though. Oh, that's incredibly bothersome, but I think I don't know how to get in there. I have to assume it's just some kind of Easter egg or something. But, oh, that's... Oh, I... I don't accept this. I'm not... I'm not done messing with this yet. Tiny little jump. Well ducked. Get in there, and then... How will I stay ducked while... Mm, I don't think I will. Now, hang on. Let's do this a little differently. So, catch that wall. Just don't go quite so high as you climb up, so, like, I'm here. No, there's no way to get up more gently than that. I feel like I'm, like, being sniped by, like, three missing tiles in the wall. <laughs> but there's definitely something there! It's a place I can stand, in theory! How could I do it in practice? Okay, now hang on, there's a... There's a height here, right? So if I... Yeah, I'm here. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm satisfied. I figured it'd be something like that. There, I don't even have to die to get out. That's a fiddly little spot to get into. Okay. So that's what's going on there. Uh, right. So there's a crystal there. I think you want me to use that to transfer to the other one of these. Maybe horizontally instead of upright. Okay, I see the suggestion. Now there's a switch in the wall. I haven't actually previewed this room with the binoculars. I'm just kind of doing it. Getting in your walls was... Just took too much of my attention to think about anything else. Yeah, okay, I see. And this also looks just like a whole lot of fun to try and sight read. Why two? Because you want a wall belts, okay? This is... this is... this is a very creative room and I appreciate it. Whoops, okay, so that, that transferring from that to a wave dash feels real weird. I did it so naturally the first several times, but I've lost my ability. It's that thing that happens when I get worse at a room before I get better at it. Whoops. Whoops, I, okay, I just did the wrong direction there, that's all. Oh, I was supposed to jump and then... Okay, right, so jump first. This is so cool. Oh, I, I had to jump straight up. I'm just not, not doing that. I, I don't think I will have enough time for that. I gotta be, like, right on the money there. So 
So much so that... Uh, not sure I'll be able to. It's funny how much just holding the climb button changes my perception of moves like the wave dash here. Like it has nothing to do with the inputs I make for it. It just it just feels different if I'm if I'm holding an extra button at the time. Uh, ah, dang it! I just I never I'm never able to read that situation and do the right thing at the at the time. So I need to memorize when I am where I do what. After I get that crystal, I'm going to be dashing left. Wall jumping straight up, dashing up, wall bouncing, grabbing. Then I want the boost. I will also have a dash. Okay, got it. Okay, so that uh, last step was important to know about. I would have died by not knowing what it was if I hadn't checked. Uh, I gotta do like this thing that I'm bad at. Good. By making me do that, I get better at it, and maybe someday I won't say I'm bad at it anymore. That'd be nice. There we go, exactly like that. Perfect. Okay, cool. And I can just resume the room from here. Got a nice little checkpoint. Why was all that? Just for fun, I guess? Okay. Uh, Alright, so I'm gonna be redding it up here. We're doing, we're playing that uh, Vaporwave level again. What was that called? I don't know. Um, it, it was was that the no no I don't remember. All right, so just doing things with boosts looks relatively simple. Uh, that wasn't exactly what I wanted. I probably I don't know. It's what I did there mostly worked. It's just my trajectory was a little wrong. I got too much boost. This felt like it wasn't what I was supposed to do here. So don't get too much. Oh. Do I need to still be pink? How would that be possible? Right, now hang on, remember. I can dash out of this without using up my... No, that's not true. I used up my hair. Wait, really? So uh, yeah, apparently a dash out of a red bubble with pink hair results in red hair. Is there... Am I supposed to keep this the entire time? That makes this a lot more complicated. But I think that's the story. I need pink hair at the end because that's a little too much distance to cross with red hair. It might be possible if I hit it just right. But no, I think the idea is I'm supposed to have pink hair at the end. So, really, it's just this first jump that's a problem for me. Let's try way earlier? Let's try way earlier? No. Let's try later? Hmm. That's not going to work. Let's try not exiting the bubble? That's the way. Okay, that's the way. Don't exit the bubble. Hooray! <laughs> fush, fush. There we go. Okay. Just don't exit the bubble. Okay, so this one's on rails. Touch switches involved. There are two of them. Okay. Uh, I didn't take in most of that, but, like, since moving platforms are involved... Okay, so you stop for a moment, then you slam me into spikes. So I need to get onto your top at that time. Then I... Okay, those things happen. I made no inputs during that section, by the way. Uh, I guess I want to grab, and then jump with a boost. Yeah, I am just... I am taken for a ride here. I probably want to springboard there. I missed it somehow. Going on a train ride in the station. This is not what a train feels like. Uh, right, so it's straight up then left. 
I have at least one dash. I don't know where's the right time to use it. That didn't feel like... Okay, so I think I see the move you want there. Ah, okay, so I have to... I have to, like, quell my hold left instincts there. Or right, or whichever direction I was holding, because I need to... I need to hit the wall in a certain way. Or that... No, that's this part. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that transfer is gonna be tricky. Uh, yep, I tried to do it, but I failed. Um, so when I'm there, I saw the situation. There was a pair of springboards there and one to my left, so I'm gonna spring spring. Hit the switch, I see another stop point, so dash into that. Then... I don't know what happens. Yeah, these binoculars only do so much for me. Like, they do not tell the story of, like, what the level state is gonna be at each point. I either went through that or hit the spikes anyway. Okay, this is a little, uh, little jank. Just a bit. No, I'm trying to... <sighs> what I'm trying to do isn't that right. I need to not move horizontally at all. When I do is when things go wrong there. <laughs> you can see what I'm trying to do. It's just not happening. And then I jumped too early. Hooah! Hey yeah, there we go. That's what I was. Hey, you left! I gotta be faster somehow? Yeah. Gotta be faster somehow. Or use my dash maybe to save myself. I think I mostly just have to be faster. Yeah. No, you, you just leave. Maybe that's the joke. It pulls away right when I would like to interact with it, and I have to instead use my dash to bounce on the other ones. Mm, a little earlier and maybe that could work? Or maybe, like, I need to do something to affect the timing. Oh. Let's see if that helps things. That might. That affects the timing in perhaps a meaningful way. Yeah, so you arrive in time for that, but therefore you are later for departing from that other place where I'm going to need you. Okay, that's the way. So after that, who knows what happens. Alright, it was a little late on that. This might not time right. It did not. Okay. So be aggressive in getting into that sphere. Uh, <laughs> It's gonna, oops, have to learn this one thing at a time. I think I'm too late. I was not quite. Jeez, uh, I have no idea what's going on there. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, so there's a, there's an orb. What do I think I'm doing with the orb? So I have hit that touch switch. I've hit that one. The bell has been rung. I think I need to get to that orb quicker than I'm getting to it and then just press left with it. Yeah. Yeah. Probably. Okay. Yeah. That is hard to not hit. And see, like, there's a timing component? I do need to steer left, like, immediately after I'm clear of that spike. I can- I have a dash. That helps. Uh, I went the wrong way, but I got away with it. Okay. I don't know what that sphere exactly was for. Probably just to, like, hold me in place for a second while all that happened. Because I don't think I could have stayed in that, regardless of which direction I had gone with it. Anyway. I'm here! Starlight Station! Alright. This feels significant. Either this is a checkpoint, or this is like, the end? Or just like a section change. Nothing there. Alright, this is a section change. Well, I'm still going, apparently. The 
the music changed a bit too. Alright, that's what the room looks like. Oh, there are... Oh, that's... Okay, let's do this then. What the heck? Are you suggesting maybe... Are you suggesting maybe that I want to do this? And then a reverse, I guess? Will that get me anywhere? Oh, I didn't extend enough. Okay, I gotta jump up again real quick. Okay, I don't want to jump off that. Okay, this is, uh, I'm gonna have to learn this one step at a time. So I do want to jump there on that second one. Okay. Then I need to dash down, possibly? It's hard to tell. If I just hold right, I don't live, so I do need to go down, probably. Then there's gonna be a springboard there at some point, which might line up with the time that I'm there, if I'm lucky. I guess I could... Uh, there's another one I can access because I have a dash. I feel like I've gone off track at that point, though. Like, something feels like it's gone wrong. There wasn't one there at that time. I guess I'll... Oh, hang on. There's a, I have another task there, don't I? Wasn't there another touch switch I was supposed to get on my way down? Yes, that's why my hang time isn't adding up. Okay. So you want that and then I dash down again. Alright. The room that makes you dash down. An action that's rarely the right action, but sometimes... I'm not doing it at the right time. Gotta be a little earlier on that second one at the very least. A little earlier. Not that early. That was way too early. Okay. Just a tiny bit earlier. Try to do it about at the time you were doing it, just, just a hair earlier. A hair. That hair was too thick. Uh, that wasn't thick enough. Dude, that's, uh, that is a weird timing window. Just because, like, springboard momentum is, again, not something I really have internalized exactly. Uh, I'm somewhere. I don't know what's happening. I missed a switch, so I gotta, like, break that op open quick, I think. So get down there with haste. What does the situation look like again? Yeah, this, this does a little, uh, dip down, then back up. So I ended up doing a super on that springboard thing, which can work. I probably want to actually dash down jump really quick to get that. Then once that's all done, I want to use the up boost of that. Probably dash upright to get into the bubble. Bubble left, I have no idea what the state of everything is then. Just hope it puts me someplace good, hit the last touch switch, boost up, jump. Who knows? Uh, I will when I get there. I saw a plausible route, but I just, I don't know what the platforms will be doing. Okay, so I can wave dash there. Okay, I did that part. I didn't get the boost, though. Everything else there was correct, though. Cool. Great, get the boost. Cool. Uh, I was supposed to wall bounce. I think I did it, but badly. However, I also need the boost from that thing to reach the other thing. <laughs> Being very precise here. And I don't know if I'm going to be in time for that. I was. There we go. Okay, that's how you do it. Cool. All right. Everything's going well. So I'm gonna bubble through there, stay in the bubble, then dash down right, I guess? Are you sure? I'm not sure of anything. Just gonna have to do it and see how it feels. 
So go over there, come back, bubbles something, go up, something something, I don't know. Okay, that feels like a conclusion. There's even like a little heart sculpture. I think this might just be the last room. Just reading into things. I'm suspicious, but there's totally nothing up there. And I can't like screen transition here. No. Okay. So what's going on with that? Obviously I need to dash down right and I guess I'll just uh, grab this? Okay. No, down right, not down left. Dash down right, but grab left. Oh, that feels weird, but don't grab, actually. Do this, jump! Uh, I need to be lower. Can I dash down? Uh, timing's too... too picky. It's picky either way. What am I doing there? I guess land real quick, then jump dash, and maybe I can get far enough to hit that crystal. With it, go up right, up left, into the bubble. Go right, dash down right again, grab the thing, go through. Get the crystal, go left, up, bubble left. Then after that, I have no idea. Ugh. This is a weird transfer. What direction do I hold when? I'm gonna hold right the whole time. I'm, like, not pressing the jump button early enough or something. Uh, okay, so I need to just jump off that, then use my dash later. Okay, so that that works, it's just... Uh, the timing is very strange, and just, like, my fingers don't understand this situation, so they're gonna keep doing the wrong thing. I have to jump at, like, my... I'm going down pretty fast there. Yeah, no, I... <laughs> I have to jump. Just don't dash, just jump. Press jump, jump, like that. Good, but then you gotta follow it up with other stuff too. Good, okay. That wasn't exactly how I planned to do that. Um, just repeat this weird motion there. Ah! Okay, I maintain some speed because I'm not... because I'm just moving forward. So yeah, I get a lot of... Bwah! <laughs> it's very uncomfortable. Hira! Uh, I just have, like, too much speed coming out of there. I need to be ready to do this weird thing a second time. And I'm just... I never am. Right. So I'm not grabbing that thing. I'm just... I'm jumping off it. What a bizarre move to base your room around. But I respect it. A unique experience. And I appreciate that there isn't, like another timing component going on with other stuff, uh, like those platforms chaining into each other. Speaking of which, what happens with this bubble? Oh, that's gonna reverse again. I do the other, th the same thing the other way around. And go through that spike. Hope I hit the pink crystal. Then what? Something I don't understand. A lot of things I don't understand. Then there's this whole thing. Okay, but then that's the end of the room. Okay, what? Yeah. Like, what does it mean to jump too early? I don't know, I... okay, so... Jump very early because it's hard to be too early. <laughs> it's easy to be too late, hard to be too early. The tra trajectories off of these things are so weird. Ah, uh, no, I need to do the thing again. So, right, that moves down. I understand. It's just. Ah. Uh, uh, it's just. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, Okay, that put me there. Oh, the uh, the pink crystal wasn't relevant because I ate it earlier. Right here, it's this one. And it doesn't come back. Okay, so I just need to uh, jump way later than that. Okay, just I just gotta see the situation, then I'll know what to do. Then once I know what to do, it'll take a few tries to actually do it, but... Oh boy.
What's my dash status when I'm there? I think I have one? And I'm using it to get to the pink crystal. Okay. Uh, I can't explain what there means he uh, here. No, I have zero, but when I hit the ground, I'll have one, and that's why I'm hitting the ground. Okay, got it. <sighs> oh, I see what's happening. My wall jump isn't going off because I reached the end of the track. Okay, if I think of things that way, everything makes more sense. Okay, um, somehow... Okay, I need to mm, jump there later. Somehow everything else worked out. Cool. Alright, yeah, so look at the end of the track for your reference point for when to jump. I was looking at something else and that's why it wasn't working well. Cool. Got my issue debugged. Now just actually do the rim. Always feels good when I figure out a thing like that and just can, can noticeably gain consistency. Like I can feel the difference. I pressed jump instead of dash. That still happens every once in a while. Great. Oh, this feels good to pull off. Oh, this feels very good to pull off. Hua! Uh, I need to do a down right and what? I guess the springboards will hit me? Oh, whoops, I wasn't looking at the track. Okay. Yeah, if my eyes are on the track, I understand when to do the thing. I guess, yeah, I'm hoping those springboards will hit me and do something good. I don't know if that's what's gonna happen, it's like something just feels wrong in that area, but I, I have to get a step farther to see if there actually is something wrong, because I don't know. Ha! No, oh, okay, I got springboarded, and I'm here. Okay, did I win? Not yet, there's another room. Is this the final room? Oh, it's long. Is there a heart in this room? It's long, but I'm probably going to be going fast. I don't see one, but I think there is one. I have a strong suspicion that as I exit that, I'm going to be at the heart. Okay. Okay, so, again, I have some preview it only means so much. What am I... how am I starting this? Maybe like that? Do you want me to not have a dash, is the idea? Okay, it doesn't matter, so, alright. I'll try and sight read this. That's a funny way to make me use my dash just for... Well, I would use it anyway for grabbing that, so it doesn't actually matter. Uh, I guess I'm doing a reverse there, probably. Dang it. Oops, no, don't jump. Just dash up. I jumped too early, got slammed by that thing, but I missed the springboard. Okay. I should probably preview more. I don't wanna, I wanna sight read. Still missed the springboard. That time I was too high, the last time I was too low, so both can be problems. Ugh. Dude, what? Yeah, preview couldn't tell me about all that. Yeah, I climbed up, that was the problem. Okay. Oops, nope, 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 don't jump. I went to, but I shouldn't. Okay, I'm in a bubble now. I don't know what's happening. Alright, so I ended up in a bubble just below an orange touch switch. I can make the inputs that got me there again. Apparently I have pink hair at that time, because I went through a crystal probably. <laughs> How would I know? Because I'm looking at it beforehand. That's the only possible way I could. That bubble's going right. 
Is it supposed to be timed with something to... No, it was timed with something. So that thing went up, then went away. My bubble slammed into spikes. I can see the height it would be at. I see an issue. And I think I know how to solve it. I need to jump out of the bubble as I'm being slammed upward. Because if I were to dash up out of that, I wouldn't get high enough to hit the touch switch and also wouldn't be high enough to set up a wave dash or something on there. But if I just jump up when I'm being slammed upward, then I can hit the switch, dash left, dash down left, do a wave. Hope there's going to be a block there. Uh, that will have opened. It probably has a springboard on it or something. Probably do a wave dash there, dash up, go right, and... That seems to be the end of the room. Uh, I will want to do something there, possibly a wave dash. What height am I at? Okay, so that's the height of that thing. I am below that. Well, I'm probably going to be moved up by a block at some point. So I don't know. That's the answer. Okay. Okay, as planned, I just didn't get the left dash quick in, in, in time. Quick enough to be in time. Oops. Uh, don't steer left there. The thing will run into you. You don't have to go catch it. Whoops. <laughs> I do need to make inputs there, though. It's just... Yeah, reaction time that's being asked for here is just a little shorter than mine. So some memorization needs to also be involved. As planned, except my wave dash was too late and I didn't get my jump. Whoops! Speaking of not getting my jumps, I didn't even press the button there. Right, it's sat. Okay, but I'm basically at the end of the room. There's like one thing left after that. I don't know how it works, but there's like one thing. What? Okay. I was supposed to jump on the second slam and get like a huge boost to the right. Okay. So here, one slam, get ready to jump. Here, a second slam, jump. Got it. That was a little early, but I got away with it. Okay, and actually, like, the number of inputs required for this isn't actually huge. It's just fast. Not very many, but very, very fast. Well, things that scroll across the screen quickly. So, like, short amount of time to figure out what I'm doing. I think I didn't have enough height there regardless of- Whoa, I- Okay, it's fine. Yeah, okay, no, it wasn't fine because that affected the timing. So I can't do that. Just this... The confluence of these things has to be just right for... For, like, this to happen. And sometimes it feels like it's not... But I can't be sure that that's the reason that I failed. There might have been other reasons. Slam, slam, I jumped. I got... Okay, that's cute. And heart is here? Heart is here, right? This is the heart room, right? This is the heart room, right? It is. There are no binoculars here. That's all I can tell. Hold up. Okay, there's nothing down there. It was suspicious enough to be worth checking. This is the heart room. I can tell. There are no binoculars. Yeah, there it is. Cool. Okay, great. And as usual, there is totally something above. Oh boy, it's a strawberry. All right, bonus challenge. It is not small. Okay. Oh, I'm only halfway scrolled through this. Oh dear. There's that strawberry. <laughs> okay, well, this is gonna take a bit, isn't it? Hard to say, it could be pretty quick. I guess I wanna wave dash there, probably. 
This level's cool. This level's very, very good. Um, well, okay, I guess I'm just... I, I don't know where the floor is, so I'm not wave-dashing in time onto it. Ha! That's the floor. I... okay, well now I did it too early. Uh, I guess I want to bubble to the... I don't know. Let's try to the right. I did up and I didn't die immediately. But I died shortly after and I'm not sure if the bubble direction was the cause or if I had to do something else there. Uh, I can't go to the right. I have to bubble up. Okay, so bubble up. That was the correct direction. Uh, whoops. Yeah, this is just- this is a level of, like, things messing with my eyes, so I don't know what timing I want to use for, uh, anything. <laughs> just have to learn another way. I think what you want to- no, I need to bubble up. Bubble up. Bubble up. Then I think you want, uh, yes, that. And then a wave dash there? Oh, jeez, okay. That's cool. I can do that. Bubble up. Ah, uh, super! No, I was trying to super, but I didn't. Ah! Uh, I don't know how much through the room I am at that point. Probably like a quarter. Bubble up. Soup. Hmm. Maybe wave would work better there? It's hard to say. I'm gonna try super again, because that worked for me once. Okay. Okay, I'm here. I'm not pressing anything, and just... I'm not pressing anything at all. Alright. So I do want to hold right and climb onto that thing, probably. Just going for a ride. Right, oops, I was too late on the thing. Okay. This is cool. And just totally wild. Uh, okay, that worked. Okay, don't press anything until... Oh, I do want to hold right that whole time, probably, because I stopped moving. Okay, so just hold right the whole time, maybe? Oops, not there. Gotta hold up in that spot. Okay. I think that was close to the end of the room, maybe? I don't know, I can't tell how much ground I covered. Uh, wave dash is definitely wrong. I need the super. That was a wave, and that was not the right move. Super. Wave. Uh, yeah, do it earlier. Okay. Wave. Super. Wave earlier. Do that. Hold right. It didn't work. The timing just wasn't set up. Okay, so I kind of got, like, unlucky there is what it feels like. But, like, how is the timing wrong? I guess that right there is a, a component of timing I control to some extent? Hmm... So that can just kind of break itself, if I'm not doing whatever the author expects me to exactly be doing. Like, I did it once. I just don't know what the difference is between that and what I did when it didn't work. Ah, uh, nope, I do know what the difference is there. Temper your instincts. Ah. I guess the, uh... When it worked, I did actually a, um... An extended hyper rather than a, a wave dash in that one spot, but I don't think that's the reason. So, like, I'm ahead right now. I'm gonna hold... Left? I'm gonna hold left and climb and see if that helps. It's supposed to be a cool triumphant moment, but now I'm just, like, stuck in trying to figure out how to make the machine work. Because, like, it's, it's just not calibrated for the inputs that I'm making. And I don't know what the difference I, is that I should, should do differently. Like, I'm doing what feels sensible here. But apparently it's not. I think I'm just too far ahead. Like, I need to slow down somehow. And that's why I'm thinking that holding left in that spot might help something, because it might slow me down a bit. But okay, so whoops, that's slowing down too much. Let's 
See, like, I'm too far ahead there. So let's go straight up into that bubble instead of upright for one thing, which also just should be generally easier. Just, like, do things late in general. Late and slow. I'm too far ahead. Late and slow. Late and slow. Ah! But see, doing that late gave me too much speed, so earlier would be slower there. I'm gonna hold left and climb. That didn't work, and that would not have arrived. What do you want me to do? Dash left? No, I think just, like, the machine's broken if I get to it in that state there. How do I fix this machine? Like, okay... Beyond this, I'm affecting your timing... I'm... well, I'm affecting the timing of where I am... ...related to, uh, the things that are going on here. It's just, it's like that spot. Maybe I don't want to wave dash, maybe I want to just jump with the momentum that I have? Wouldn't that make me go even faster, though? And would it even give me the right trajectory? Also, I'm just, like, landing in the wrong spot. Like, this... This super here, this is the problem. Yeah, right there is where I die. Because I'm going too fast, I have to slow down somehow. It's just, I get too much speed with that super. Okay, now I have pink hair at that... No, I don't. I, I don't know how to do this. Like, I can't control the amount of speed I get there, it's just, it's gonna be variable. Sometimes it's not enough, sometimes it's too much, sometimes the machine works, sometimes the machine breaks. Oh, uh, this is disappointing. Like, it's just, it's too, too precisely set up to work with, like, whatever inputs I happen to be making at the time. Unfortunate. Like, it's supposed to normalize- well, no, hang on, it does normalize my position. No, 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 I am, I am normalized after I get in that bubble. Because it pushes me forward. So how am I managing to break this? Wait, no, this doesn't make sense. How am I managing to break this? Like that? The timing of that th ah, thing right- ah, there. Right, so right there, I'm normalized. So I'm touching nothing. Okay, I'm touching nothing. This time it worked. This time I grabbed. I'm here at the strawberry. Alright, the machine eventually worked. Good enough. I barely know what I did. But I did it. Huh. That is a dangerous spot to hide a strawberry because a slightly missed dash would end the level and I'd have to do the whole thing over again. Fortunately, that's not what happened. Okay, good. Got all strawberries. Alright, cool level. Lots of fun. Great time. Uh, this is an exit, right? Apparently. Journal. That was lovely. Uh, where is your sticker? Where is your sticker? Is it there between the portal level and the umbrella level? Like upper center right? I don't recognize that, so I assume so. I don't quite see how that's Starlight Station themed though. Is that the adornment that's on the blocks that we're doing those things? Maybe. Anyway, I think that's the, the sticker that is new. Alright, next up is Dusk City. Let's go find it. It could be any red lid. Is it that one just to the right? Dusk City. There's still a lot left. How many are left, actually? If I bump into another journal, I'll check. It looked like eight-ish. You could be Dusk City. You're not, though. That's Call of the Void. Okay, there's a red over there. Uh, somewhere... Here you are... Dusk City! There we go, I found it. Um, I still want to answer my question though, and I am near a journal. There are... one, two, three, four, five, six, seven left. Okay, seven left! 
getting there, and then there's gonna be a gigantic heart side level. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be huge. Uh, so we'll be there for a while. Anyway, um, so, uh, Dusk City, next time, I'll see you then.